Hello, welcome to the East Port of Spain Development Company Limited. Please join me on a brief journey so that we can share with you some information about our company and the communities which we serve. East Port of Spain is a district within the metropolitan area of Greater Port of Spain. It covers an area of 6,791.8 acres or 2,748.6 hectares and has a population of approximately 76,453 persons in 24,184 households. In 2005, the area referred to as the East Port of Spain Metropolitan District was declared a special development zone. Special attention was to be paid to the economic and social challenges faced by its residents. The ultimate goal of this initiative was to reduce regional disparities and create sustainable communities. Cabinet in September 2005 agreed to the incorporation of the East Port of Spain Development Company as a limited liability company wholly owned by the government of Trinidad and Tobago. The company's mandate? To develop and redevelop a zone in East Port of Spain to improve the economic, social and physical environment. The area is bounded by Charlotte Street to the west, Lady Young Road to the north, and Beetham Highway to the south, including the communities of Coconut Drive, Never Dirty, Monrepo, Mary Road, Romaine Lands, Caledonia No. 2, and Sea Lots. The vision of the company is to be the recognized authority on transformative urban regeneration. Our mission? Transforming of East Port of Spain through economic, social, and physical regeneration leveraging our collective skills and competencies, delivering quality services with the efficiency and integrity to the citizens and stakeholders of East Port of Spain, respecting the rights, dignity and humanity of all, the company's valued position, communication, courtesy and respect, integrity, teamwork, responsibility, commitment. The company exercises its mission in partnership with key stakeholders, including the community, to improve the quality of life of its residents and to celebrate its cultural heritage and achievements via its strategic development plan as a coordinating mechanism for action. Its transformation through regeneration strategy requires teamwork, delivery and respect. The company's strategic development plan allows for incremental implementation of projects selected in alignment with the National Development Strategy and the UN's Sustainable Development Goals. The path to urban revitalization articulated in the plan is built around four development strategies. One, enhancing community and surroundings. Two, developing the business ecosystem. Three, re-establishing safety and security, and four, focusing on the people. The area, described as East Port of Spain under the jurisdiction of the company, comprises a network of 19 diverse urban communities, which vary in size, topography, population, layout, services, and appearance. It is the birthplace of the Steel Pan, Calypso, and Carnival, and has produced icons in the fields of culture, education, law, business, sport, and the arts. The area is rich in history and cultural traditions and boasts of a number of heritage sites of national and international significance. East Port of Spain, however, is in need of transformation, addressing the developmental gaps and spatial inequities identified and highlighted in the company's draft strategic development plan. Increased connectivity between communities through vehicular and pedestrian access roads, digital connectivity 
and social intervention are some of the areas that continue to provide opportunities for growth, entrepreneurial activity, and training in skills development through its social and economic programs, providing accommodation for sport as well as active and passive recreation, and the countless initiatives putting the company on the path to fulfilling its transformative agenda for East Port of Spain. Some of our projects include, but are not limited to, East Dry River Park, a public park that is envisioned to turn an underutilized city asset into a functional, inviting, and transformational public space. The Brian Laura Promenade Extension, an extension of one of the nation's great urban spaces to further improve the connectivity to the square from East Port of Spain. The Vieira Street Roundabout, an artistically planned welcome entrance will define the character and spirit of East Port of Spain. The result will be a more inviting and safe space for pedestrians. The Lady Young Roundabout, replacing that major intersection with a roundabout inclusive of slip lanes. Eastern Main Road Triangle Park, the realignment of the old St. Joseph Road and its intersection with the Eastern Main Road. The Lady Young Road Lookout, upgrade, expand and redesign the lookout space with an overhanging terrace in order to increase sight area with an observation deck inclusive of a vending area, street cafes, observation deck and enhanced sight features. Central Market Upgrade As one of the major markets on the island, EPOS proposes to upgrade the structure, formalize parking, and address other functional improvements. East Side Plaza A new mid-block passage will connect Charlotte Street to the promenade. This will be lined with small retail spaces that can be utilized as incubator spaces with an emphasis on local crafts. These, among countless other already designed projects, will improve the landscape of East Port of Spain. In spite of high levels of public insecurity, under-resourced communities, and a number of negative stereotypes, East Port of Spain is envisaged as a vibrant cultural center, an innovative and resilient economic engine, and a network of sustainable and desirable communities of choice, and a flagship of creativity and innovation. The company's strategic focus is on comprehensive and integrated planning and development as it undertakes a number of physical, social, and economic projects in the area under its jurisdiction. The company has recognized the need for a clear vision encapsulated in a plan derived with input from the communities. The company's draft strategic development plan for East Port of Spain adopts a long-term perspective and comprehensive approach to the regeneration and transformation of East Port of Spain. The company's core business activities are comprehensive and integrated development planning, community engagement and public consultations, project identification and conceptualization, our challenges include, but are not limited to, topography, crime and violence, infrastructure deficiencies, urban decay, unplanned settlements. The guiding policy principles derived from the vision statement proposes to shape the development of the East Port of Spain Metropolitan District, build on the foundation of existing local assets, minimize the dislocation of existing residents, increase sustainability and socio-economic resilience, utilize an inclusive and collaborative approach, ensure a safe, healthy, and attractive environment, ensure equity in access to basic amenities and services, balance funding and other resources, the East Port of Spain Development Company Limited is an agency of the Ministry of Housing and Urban Development, governed by a board of directors, and has as its lead a managing director. The company remains committed to the absolute regeneration of East Port of Spain, 
to improve the quality of living for its residents and provide opportunities for growth for the wider Trinidad and Tobago. Thank you for joining us on this brief journey of East Port of Spain, our company and our communities. We hope you have a better understanding of who we are and the work that we do.